And that particular night, I was gone already, but that particular night, I ended up in, in a vacant home, um, sleeping inside of a vacant house in Baltimore City. What was what, what was the feeling inside of you, sleeping in homes, having to eat? Because I want people to see, because we see a lot of fo- homeless folks, mm-hmm. and, and we don't know the circumstances of it. Like, w- yours is another circumstance of being underage, your mother putting you out, you forced to sleep in vacant homes under bridges, eating out the trash cans. How did that make you feel? inside like how did that make you feel um loss i i felt like i didn't matter i felt like nobody cared about me you know literally no one cared about me um i had to fight and and like i i always tell people like oprah winfrey said in the color purple all my life i had to fight and, and that's what it was for me. Um, every night, you know, when I was out there um, sleeping in the streets, um, I had to watch my back. I always got to look over my shoulder. Um, I didn't have anyone to turn to. You know, um, my life wasn't you no know, cakewalk. You know, it was very, very difficult. But I was scared, you know, um, I was lonely. I didn't have anyone to protect me. I didn't feel that no one loved me. Um, I'm out here in these streets fighting a battle every night. But I got to a place where I didn't want to be here anymore. I wanted to commit suicide because it was like enough is enough. But I didn't because my daughter is what saved me. My daughter was what gave me the push to keep on pushing. Have and you I ever think that's why suicide? I did with um I tried to do that when I was 13 with my father's medication. Um it didn't work because I'm sitting here. <laughs> but um, 2019, um, was the year that my life just changed. Um, 